We're here at Unique Truck Accessories to talk about our Crossover Brute Commercial Series boxes. This is Greg. Greg, can you uh, take us through the finer points? Today we're going to show you our part number RB121LP. This is our low profile version of our crossover. We are, our standard crossover is about three inches taller than this. We do this in a low profile also so you can see out the back window. It makes it much easier, but it is offered in two heights. Now we're going to take you to the outside of the box first. Now typically with a, a crossover toolbox, people think all oh, crossover toolboxes are all built the same. Well there's quite a few unique features that I'd like to show you with this box. In particular, we'll start off with our push button. Now our push button has a stainless steel bezel. This isn't powder coated so it isn't going to corrode, it isn't going to rust. And it, it activates a linkage on the inside of the box from either end of the box. Now we have a sturdy lid construction, it's reinforced, we'll show you that in a minute. And it's reinforced with struts going lengthways with the box for extra stiffness. You can sit or you can stand on this box with no problem. We also have reinforced channels on the outside of the box. Uh, they act as a, as a means to, uh, uh, for the tray to slide on, but also reinforce the front and the back of the box. Now I'm going to take you to the inside of the box. first thing I want to show you about the inside of the box is the actual construction of the floor. Now you can't see this, but underneath each and every crossover floor, we have reinforced struts. We have four of them per box. Unlike every other box on the market, the floors themselves are not reinforced, so you get a bowing effect. This won't happen with this box. Another thing that you might notice is we have a sliding tray. It has removable dividers. Uh, that way you can put all your small tools and various items uh, within the tray. We also have reinforced gas struts, and this is, these are reinforced in an area so that if the tray slides back or any of your larger items, they won't damage the shock. You also see a, a tool compartment on each end of the box. Uh, we have screwdriver holders, but there's only so many screwdrivers that you need, so we also have some slots where you can put various wrenches. Take a look at this linkage. Now this is the linkage that we talked about earlier activated by a push button on each end. What we have is, is a reinforced channel in the front that covers all of the linkage so that there can be no damage with, it, with the linkage itself. Inside, there are two position rotaries, and uh, these rotaries, they're actually a dual action, and as they close, it, it, it allows the box then uh, to be extra secure because there's actually two positions then to locking the box. You, know, you might notice our standard uh, neoprene seal that's around the edge of the lid comes standard on all of our boxes. And then of course uh, the, the stiffener arrangement inside the lid. This makes for a very sturdy and very durable toolbox. If you'd like to know more about this, you can always look at, look at our website. It's www.uniquetruckaccessories.com.